Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. to my dear students. This is your math class and welcome to class 2. These are the learning objectives which we will cover in second week of July. These are place values of two digits numbers. Number in words. Count by abacus, ascending and descending order. Now, first of all, place values. Students, here you see the number is shown 53. If we change the position of the single digit, now the number will be changed as 35. So, here you can see 53 and 35 both have same digits but the place of digits are different. By just changing the position of one digit, the value of number is changed. Place value is the value of the position of a number. Now let's know about tens and ones. As you can see, there is a group of some color pencils together in a box. Let's count it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It means one group of tens having 10 color pencils and on the other side there are 4 color pencils. They are not in group so it will be count individually. Let's count 1, 2, 3, 4. So it will be 4 ones only. Now let's put these in tens and one columns. So our number comes out as 40. Do remember 110 is equal to 10 ones. So here you can see two groups of tens means 20. As same as three group of tens means 30. 4 group of 10s, 40. Now, take out your book and open page number 4. Do exercise 6. How many 10s are there? As you can see, there is a 2 group of color pencil box. Let's count it. Yes, it is 20. So, it means it having two tens. Okay. Now, on the other count, the separated pencils, how many are they? Yes, right. They are six. So, let's write six in ones. Now, Add two tens and six ones and it will be equal to 26. Now, do all the part with the same method. Do exercise 7 on page number 5. Write the numbers according to the place value. Three tens and six ones. The place value will be equal to 36. 5 tens and 3 ones, the place value will be equal to 53. Now do the place value of 5 tens in 50, the place value of 5 tens is 50 and 3 ones is 53. 
now do all the parts with the same instructions number in words here is the example you can see there is 110 one, 11 one, the place value is 11 now we say in words 11 e l e v e n and same for number 13 one tens and one, three ones the place value is 13 in number and we say in words 13 t h i e r t w e n 13 do exercise 8 on page number 5 Write in words four tens and five ones. The place value of four tens is forty, and five one is five. So we will write in words at forty-five. F O R T Y forty, F I V E five. Its number name is forty-five. Now complete all the following parts given in book. Now let's learn about the abacus by counting the beads given in tens and ones. Here you can see tens having how many beads? Three beads and ones having two beads. Let's write eight. S thirty two. Hmm. Do exercise nine on page number six. How many tens? How many ones? Look at the abacus, then fill in empty boxes. One has been done for you. and in the b part as you can see there are eight tens there are eight tens and two ones write down the number 82 and then write eight tens and two ones equal to 80 plus 2 now complete all the parts given in book now do exercise 10 on page number 6 hope you remember ascending and descending order as we'll discuss already learned in previous lesson do you remember what is descending and what is ascending ascending order means when number are arranged from smallest to biggest okay and descending order means when numbers are arranged from biggest to smallest okay now complete this okay students let's wind up our weekly homework take care allah hafiz